never can hold us down. We see feather than they could see. We stay grinding, hard working while the rest choose sleep. No one ever wins without sacrifice. It's that deep. We're creation of beasts. Creation of beasts. What's going on YouTube? You're now watching Creation of Beast. Beast. My name's D Knight. And my name's Bravo. And today was a nice shoulder session. Pause. Before we start talking about this session, first we need to say a big and huge thank you to Gabriel Say. Jeez. He uploaded one of our videos on his channel. Much, much, much love, much appreciated. And we also need to say another thank you because he's not the only one that showed love. Huge shout out to Alex over at Alpha Mentality Fitness. He showcased our video. Big respect to you and much love. Cheers. Beasta. Beasta. Oh, yo, I love the way you've done that, bro. It sounds better than mine. <laughs> decided to do seated behind the neck press we're trying to really get strong at this movement and um, we've seen a few guys do it on YouTube they seem to beast like seriously seriously beast on this standing up 40 is it 40 a side 40 a side that's, that's obviously kg in pounds I don't know <laughs> gonna have to google it <laughs> yeah <laughs> but yeah but they do 40 a side standing up which is impressive it's definitely beast material. This is something that I used to do a few years ago, but I was at a more, you know, that manly weights gym, you know, where there's only guys in the gym. Yeah. You, you seem to get strong. Well, I was a lot stronger to be fair, because I used to do 50 kg on this. I was a lot lighter and a lot stronger. So this is something that I want to get back to. It's my new challenge for 2016. For I want us both to be beasting on 50, and then gradually we should get stronger at standing up because I want to be able to do that 40. <laughs> the yeah. 40 behind the head. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> We warmed up on this exercise with 10 kg aside. We were supposed to only do 10 reps, but I decided to do 20. It wasn't feeling that hard, and I wanted to make sure that my joints were fully warm. I then gradually increased the weight by 10. I finished on 30 kilos aside. I finished on 35, which I am still not happy with because it's still 15 kg off my PB best. And I'm gonna get there, people. You're gonna see us get there, huh? I felt like I needed to get a spot for 35 kg because it's new to us. I think this is the second time we've actually done this exercise in a few years. I felt like I needed that reassurance to make sure that in case I failed, that someone could grab it. I did only get, I think I got one rep by myself and the second one I needed a slight touch. You know when you find someone that can spot correct, jeez, it's like you feel like worshipping them because he did not pull it off me. Usually a guy will just come in straight away, girl, I've got it, it's yours. Yeah, no, take away, he yeah. made sure I struggled from the start to the finish. Behind the camera, I was like, yo, mate, best spot ever. Okay, so as we felt that we couldn't go any higher, as we was only getting two reps, three reps, the next step was to pyramid back down. As my max weight was 30 kilos, I went down to 20 kilos. Bravo went down in five kilos. And also, just so you know, if you ever hear me say 35 kg, I do just mean one side, I don't mean the total amount. If you ever notice when you say to someone, what's your max weight? And they say 157.5. You end up having to get a pen, paper, everything, start jotting it down, start doing divisions. 
just to know what they mean, what yeah. weight they had on every side. So just to prevent that, I always just say the one side, it's a lot easier because everyone knows the bar weighs 20 kg. Yeah, yeah. So if I say 35, you know straight away if you can do that weight. It's a lot easier for all parties. Okay, so after we finished off with the shoulder press, our arms were super pumped. I mean, for why not work on our abs as summer's six months away and everyone wants a nice <laughs> eight bro. pack. If you want that eight pack, you got to start training your abs three summers before. And not everyone can even form an eight pack, no matter how clean your diet is. Some people can only form six. Like me, I'm the unlucky one. I'm the lucky one that I can get eight. A six pack for me is four. Like, that's if I'm not even trying, luckily. Mm. Um, eight is when my diet is peak and on point and obviously more for the summertime. <laughs> Now the reason why we do it on the seat is because of my knees. Uh, when you use a mat, they're thin as a bed sheet, so it still hurts my knees. And also I don't like when people step over you, or jump over you, walk over you, or when you're on the floor doing your ab crunches. I'm really funny about personal space. I don't really like when people invade it, especially when I'm down on the floor, head down, can't really see what's going on. Okay, so that's the end of our video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Please feel free to like, subscribe, share, and comment. And follow me on Instagram. My name is DNightLDN. And mine is Love PD Bravo. Keep beasting. Cheers!